and we are at Sinote Azul. Acha, so as soon as we have entered, we bought our tickets there. And uh, the first thing that we have to do is go and take a shower because you need to clean yourself, like the whole body, and uh, only then you can enter the cenotes. And this is where the banyas is. It is so cute. We have decided to come like at 9 a.m. There is not a lot of people here. So if you are coming here to any cenote, we have been told that you should come here at 9 a.m. As soon as it opens, because then there is less crowd. And it's true. There's not too many people around. My bag is with me. And uh, there's my husband. Where do we have to go? This is so pretty. It's like, oh, look at this. Oh, this is so cute. Look at that. Whoa. As soon as you walk in, there is two pools. One is this. One is this. It is so pretty. Be very careful. Hey, you have to do it again. Because a lot of places are slippery. Such a water baby. While I sit and soak up the sun, he is so cute. He's been trying to get me in that bunny for a while. If you are wondering why I am not in the bunny, it's because I can't swim. <laughs> yes, fun fact I can't swim. I have old bikini photos and I'm always doing beach holidays but I cannot swim. Anyways, my husband is doing everything and I have been walking around in the shallow water. But this place is so good. You guys have to have to visit Cenote Azul. There is a lot of 
uh, cenotes around here in this area okay. so you definitely it's a must do when you are in Mexico let me look for my husband hi water baby Sorry. <laughs> the water baby is finally coming out. Did you have fun, Jan? And this is where everyone jumps off from. Hi everyone! If you come here to Azul Cenote, you need at least two hours. So make sure you have two to three hours because the water is amazing. And one quick tip, try and come at 8.39 in the morning because it's empty when you enter, isn't it? It is. Like, share and follow everyone to see more and more updates of us. <laughs>